Hi then, hello and welcome to the XI Racing League F1 Division Round number 7 here at Canada. They're currently in qualifying with around 14 minutes left. The session it is a bit cloudy and will be cloudy in the race as well. No chance of rain from what has been shown in qualifying. Um, 70 laps, it's a full 100% race. And is it really 70 laps? Wow, that's quite a... Is it really? Wow, that's... That's going to be fun, isn't it, for these drivers. Um, they will have to apparently use the soft compound tyre, because there is a super soft, ultra soft inches and wets. We won't be seeing the inches or wets here today. I will have Phil uh, Hampton joining me once he gets here. On the cars there as well. At qualifying. New way of doing things. Well, Back to the old ways with the laptop, but the new system of OBS finally got round to using that. Look, it's pretty helpful. It's a little bit weird or different. Probably not going to change in detail. It's all new. We've been doing testing with day to do it. Not got it 100% down. Um, it's time for some high loads in the chat. Quickly, 20 low 21s are the good ones. So, Ryan's not with he's on one, of the one. Let's see what Ryan does into the last chicane. That's a lot of the first curve, so he's actually going to have a lot of the first curve. That worked really well. He comes across another 12.7 to go third place. what he does in this last two corners. Sort of the same tactic, not really done as well as Ryan sticks it all the way to the right. It's a 12.5 to go third now, beating Ryan. Locks in second at the moment, RG. He's in first currently with times of 120, 112.3, 112.5, 112.5, 112.7, 112.7. 12.9, so it's very, very close in the top five, and really top six as well. That's a nice first sector. A good last like, second middle sector, but it's all about the lower chicane then. In this last sector, can Ryan get a good chicane? Quick lap at the 112.3 in second place. It is close at the top by one zero point zero one eight. RG stays on pole just for now. Long way to go in this session yet. It's time to come very quickly down. Just literally currently done a nice good first sector. So we on board with Trinus in the Mercedes. Um, Good with the volumes and everything. Nice to Good evening to you, uh, Matty Man. Turn up your voice, so Stucky. There we go. Turning up my voice. Boom. Tell me if that's better, Stucky. Once you know it. Um, I'm just going to go. Because I can. Here we go into the last sector. Now, a bit of a different line. Nearly hits the wall of champions there, Trimus. Takes a lot more of the second curb. An LGS or Ryan, but does a 13.1, puts himself 7th at the moment. It's a good time. So, yeah, interesting two lines about it. Adam done a nice first sector and a nice decent second sector. Let's see what Adam does. Adam won 5 0 9. Let's see what he can do. He's currently 8th at the moment. Because I don't hear any sounds, though, that's why I always ask. Because I can't, there's so many things going, but there's no actual sound coming from anywhere. Different line again, but it always cut. I just noticed that on this lap, sadly. Um, a 
is ours, not really a quick one. Little Nash has just come out, Archie's coming back out now. Sean Bean's out there, the race winner last time out in Monaco. By the way, with this new, the way this all new, new stuff now works, um, I can bring graphics back. Woohoo! So the V champs are standing next week and stuff like that. Sean sure looks ready to start. Now that we're just watching the first two corners of this match. Of course, he did win last time out in Monte Carlo. Clips the apex quite nicely there. Turn two to see where he is. He's sixth place in the championship standings because of that. Nails though, turn three and turn four. Very difficult to see what his first sector is now. It's close to the wall on the inside. It's a dead 21 to head on in the first sector. So it's a good lap time. We have Aaron or Pure Hampton is back. And can commentate with me in the last no minutes really of qualifying. Things have to be done. Because I hope your audio <laughs> things have to be done. I hope your audio works because it should be. Should be a lot louder than the. Uh, Hopefully it works. Yeah, should be anyway. Hopefully. Wait, I can't do anything here. Yeah. Yeah, well, the only thing I can do is tell you to turn it up. Do it. Do it should be fine. Normally, you always used yeah, to be. Should be fine. So here we go. Sean Bean currently fifth in the minute at qualifying. Comes down to the last chicane once again. How's he going to take it? He's done in different lines already. He takes it like LGS and Ryan. Really well, no oversteer, not as much anyway. 12.7 says fifth. Uh, Harris has done a nice first set of 21.1. Carly's done a nice first set of 21.1. Tenth place, uh, Azar, that was like a warm up lap, 14.7. Fat Penguin, is this a warm up lap? No, it's not, it's a very nice first set, a decent second set. Here we go, Fat Penguin from 11 goes sixth place with a 12.777. So there's a lot of 12s here, Harris. He's the secretary. He's actually catched, caught up even with Nicole. It seems they're very close to each other, but they're both on good laps. I don't think they're going to do anything. Azar's in a very nice first sector. Oh, it's cut. Maybe that's why. Um, oh, jeez. Backed off in the second sector, I believe, though. Yeah, definitely. Oh, my God. Otherwise, that was a nice first sector. So loud in the wall. Oh, I out of the way of our current teammate Harris, which is in seven now. I wonder if he just approved. I mean, my told. I can't see any damage in the car, but it probably is. See what Avi's eye has done. Well, that doesn't actually matter because he's cut his lap, didn't he? Ryan, nice first set to 20.8 to adjust for the chicane. That is on the limit. It's a very nice chicane. Can't see his you going fully fast? I can't tell. No, yes, no, no. No, back off. Long beans one first. I can't tell because there's no sound. Oh, God, yeah, big, really? Big slide by OGS there. 12, has he really? Oh, one too far now. Ooh, he yeah, has. Oh my God, that is close. Look at the top. Top three not even covered by one tenth of a second. Top five covered by just about three tenths. It is very, very close. And we do have. 12 drivers. Lee got this cozy with, with the wall. I'm gonna get too cozy. Massive's got a bit too cozy at the wall as well, the wall of champions or something, because he's missing a left front end plate going across the start line. Not having much star start to that up. Uh, Ryan has just done a 20.7 in the first sector and he's sliding his rear end into the corner so very interesting way of doing it. I'm liking the ways we're doing things here. What are we seeing? Uh, Eagle says, hey, hello to Eagle. Chucky, you asked me to turn up my voice and I did but you never said if it sounds better or not. I hope it does. It's a good, it's a good lap here by Ryan. Third place at the moment. It only takes a, not even a tenth to get him in the pavilion of pole. Yeah. Oh sure, yeah, yes. You are correct. All he needs is less than a tenth and he's in the pole. That is crucial. Oh, I'll put it here. Adam one five oh nine. It's under five minutes left in this session now. Oh. Adam Attacks that chicane he's cut, the second part. The car is spun then. 
uh, Massa's got some damage, we you know. Azar's preparing. Primus, the new driver, got a 21.2 in his first sector. Nailed that. Interesting to see what the limit of the track is and everything there. Good middle sector as well. Last year okay. I'm liking how some people are doing it. They're taking a lot of the first set part, but not any of the second. But a lot of the first, none of the second. Yep, that's exactly probably the line to take. And then stay to the right. To 12.9, puts himself seventh place. Improves a position. Which one on dead and the one. Back out of the road, the balls are coming back out now. There's a good lap by Adam, 1509 here, puts himself 6th place, 12.7. So about Azar, he's currently last in 12th place. I don't know if he's actually put a lap yeah, in Yeah, he's not a fast one now. He's uh, got a nice first second hand second. Learning tips here is what I'm doing, picking up tips from watching qualify here with the, all these lot. Harris has done a nice size oh, pass over. Now he's just getting ready. Oh, he's. Yeah. Doesn't even want to fly him out, but I just can't see any numbers. There's a lot of cutting going on. Sean Bean is stalling. He's one now. Two minutes to go. So he can have another crack at it. Tax turn one. He's the master of Monte Carlo. Got the race win there. He wants to make it two here in Canada. Is that a cut? That's a cut. Is it too early to turn three? Ryan's done a 20.7 in sector one. Ooh. Ooh. He's getting a bit intimate with the wall. Bad idea. Not the best middle though. Five turns off the best middle. But then again, Ryan's equal with that. Jock's done a nice first act. He's just lost flat. Oh, yes. oh, he's missed it. He's really missed that one. Yeah, he takes it. Well, Ryan doesn't. 1128. Ah, oh, Ryan can't hit. Uh, Jock hasn't caught his, though. It's a nice lap here from Jock. Currently fifth place. Harris. Oh, it always looks like he's definitely turned into a cut. 12 9. Oh, I'm just been saved. Oh, uh, Tremus is off the road. Uh, exit turn two. Gets out of the way of the drivers. Interesting one. Oh, Sean Bean, yeah. He's, uh, been on one. He's on one, definitely. Ethan's not looking forward to this, doesn't like this track. Turn up volume and a tad and Your game down. No. Okay. Oh, that penguin's crashed. That penguin is crashed. Can't really turn mine any more up. Turn the game volume down, but oh, yep, God, that's happened. It says he's a thousands up. I 
don't know if he improved. Possibly bend it. I think people are in the pits retiring probably. Or oh, they're all just crashing. RG, I uh, don't know if he's on one. Did he back off today? Back down to the car and don't know if she backed off. He's mild. Can't tell because there's no sound. Yep. So that is qualifying. Done and dusted. I'm trying to walk out all these audios. I can get mine sorted, but if it's a case of few engines, might we can't really do much about it. Let's hope it's not. It shouldn't be. I'd like to stand up. But, um, it could be you never know. Um, yeah. Well, where's what we're gonna do off the, off the start? Get um, disqualified. That's much clearer. Good, good, good. That's much clearer. I'm gonna go try and get disqualified. So it's much clearer. Thank you, rightful chip. Yep. So uh, qualifying goes like this: Sean Bean takes pole position by two uh, two temps. He did improve to a 12.1. RG in second, third Ryan, fourth Azar, amazingly in fourth. Jock fifth, LGS sixth, Adam seventh, Fat Penguin eighth, Harris ninth, Trimus tenth. 11th is Nicole and 12th is uh, Felipe Massa. Very close grid. Top 10 covered by 7 Very temps. Close, except for, except from Top 6 covered except by 4. Between 12th and 11th for it's about 2 seconds. Well, just under 2 seconds. Yeah. Look like he can get a lap in. Oh. Ooh. Where's did you check the weather? Alright, thank you. Dry anyway. Yeah, it said uh, yeah, cloudy. Yeah. Cloudy. Right. Yeah, very oh god, horrible. Hundred percent, and I believe it's seventy laps is what it said on the graphic earlier yeah. from Samster. So here we go. They've already immediately gone. Um, I think Sean Bean's just sent me the dab message. We're about to find out. Dab You're dab. Jump. You, you just what jump the? F start, then reverse. No, he went. What the? F ha ha ha. Sean being very very happy with yeah, I will I jump definitely jump straight into it. He's he's very happy with pole position. He won at Monte Carlo. He's stuck it on pole here. Jock is a leader in the championship by 11 points. Back to Ryan. They have not had the best qualifying by a long way. Boom, got it right. Disqualification. The five lights are out. I can't see anything because there's just smoke into turn one. It looks well. clean, I'm saying. Yeah. Can I re get... Can I... I'm following them. Hey, it's changed. Oh, 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 there's a LGS in the wall. Oh, there's a slight contact further back with uh, Tremus and a Mercedes. Um, Tremus is a Mercedes, so Tremus and somebody. I think it may have been actually Fat Penguin that he had contact with. Didn't really catch. It. I sort of saw it, but didn't get all of it. Just a bit of chaos at the back here oh, between a bunch of cars. Oh, oh, oh. There's an interesting one here. Uh, trying to work out where everyone is. Our team is just falling further down. You said about oh, oh, oh there's um contact between Adam and R G. Jorks for as well. Jorks through. Oh, Ryan nearly goes in the back of him. Oh, what the hell? What's going on here? Tremus just had a light bit of contact with L G S, which survives. Harris has just gone through. It's all a bit chaotic into turn one. I'm not actually sure what's going on. Felipe Massa has just. Past Tremus, which then goes up the back of Massa, which gets front wing damage and then gets passed by Nicole uh, as well. Trying to work out exactly what's going on. Oh, Adam's going slowly and he's being passed left, right, and centre. Uh, oh, Harris is side by side with Adam. I don't know if struggling. Good racing, Harris taps the wall. Oh, Adam! We've got Massa nearly spun into the wall then. <coughs> I 
it's a bit chaotic in these first couple of laps here. I'm trying to actually know who's where. We can go further up and see. Um, Sean Bean is leading, followed by Ava, followed, which is on the Super Softs. So he, I think he did crash in qualifying, meaning he would get Super Soft to start on. So yeah, there you go. He probably did crash then. I would explain the text when he said didn't go very well, or didn't go to plan. Now it's Adam versus Adam. Oh, that would be Tremus. Oh, caught a slight contact, but they managed to resolve it. And Adam stays ahead of Adam, it seems. And Banana Adam. I'm having some... The cars don't, definitely aren't driving straight, I'm going to say that now. I'm not sure if they're having any lag in the game, but... I don't know for you. They're not actually driving straight, are they? They're driving straight for me. They're driving weird. It's like they constantly got a bit of wheel spin. Like people are hitting the back of each other, but on my screen they haven't touched each other. They've been close, but they've actually... Definitely seen some slight contact. Masses just passed Adam. Gets him for the arrest. The Hasses are together of Harris and Nicole. Sliding. Oh, well, he just had a massive side there, but interesting. <coughs> Ryan's now still on the back of Joel. Interesting how he's going there. Yeah, Adam. Adam's continued to fight. <laughs> DRS is always a fun thing around this track. Yeah, and that one isn't done on where it is. That's in there, isn't it? Hitting early. Interesting. So a big slide now, Jess. Oh, the second and third, second and third, yeah. Jock and Ryan closing in on Ava, uh, which is on the super soft, so it makes yeah, a bit more sense. Yeah, that 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 makes sense. If it was, oh god, the Adams getting close to each other. Ooh. Here we go. The oh, Adam the fight outside. continues. One goes to the inside. One goes to the outside. Oh, it's all good. Oh, massive no. slide. Slides them Oh, oh. Okay, <laughs> kept out of the wall, didn't it? Did he keep out of the wall? Amazing. And here comes the car, which just passed Harris for night. And Adam is still back to Adam. Adam is going to get DRS on Adam. Adam is not going to get DRS. Oh, no, this Adam got DRS. Adam's going to get DRS on the other Adam. <laughs> The Adam that's ahead of Adam gets the arrest on Adam. Oh, Nicole's going to go into the slow to me. Did she have touched the back of him? Possibly not. Harris pits, by the way. Oh, yes. Oh, really? They got a more interesting one. As the Adams continue to fight. Yeah, well, Jock's definitely now on the back. They definitely are, yeah. Jock is on the back of Azar for second place. And all big, big slide. Jock's not able to get through. Got might go for it. Decides not. DRS oh. is a very powerful thing. Woo hey, big, big slide. That's the corner I hate. And there's the reason for it. Nice save, though. Will Jock do anything into the heaven? Decide not. 
room was definitely given. It seems like that out of all, a lot of the balls on the are just spinning those guys up. You can see they you, are, you, it's you can a see horrible the track for the broadcast, you know, just slightly going sideways. It annoys me slightly because you can just see the cars going sideways. Is it really? Yeah, it is. Most corners they are actually just drifting out of. Slightly off putting as you think maybe they're. No, no, but nope. Adam and Adam's fight stops. Nicole now in the pits. A lot of these are drive throughs, by the way. Cause they're, yeah, oh, they're oh, not actually. Just it's just that pit, pit stops really far down. Problem, she's in the pits now. Ultra sauce? Right, so there's been a few pit stops I'll do it in. Oh, my game just froze on me. I can't skip. Right, I'm. F <laughs> Great, I'm froze on the screen. I hope that this changes at some point. Yeah, change camera is a good call. Boom. No, it's not worked. Oh, there you go. It has eventually worked as I put it back. Good, good. Oh, Nicole's gone off the track. RG Matiz must have had a drive through because he's in 12th place on the soft tyre, by the way. So, don't have a clue what's going on there. One Williams winning, one Williams in last place. Battle for second is definitely on. Yeah. Really large sandwich. Right, still on the back of Of course, penalties are an easy thing to get around here for corner cuts, so it's one thing the drivers will be looking at. 70 lap race. Oh, LGS in fifth. Spread out a little bit further back now. Um, so it's definitely the battle. Oh, so a mistake then by Jot there. Bit deep. Definitely a bit deep by Ryan, but DRS will be going Jock's way, so third place might be going back to him immediately. Oh wow, that's just you can just see the extra power from there. Wow. Bye bye Ryan. Definitely have to break a little bit earlier with DRS. As he does. They are on the back of Sean Bean, are they not? Yeah, they are. Yeah, Look yeah. how close they are now. Sure. Just really reeling him in. Must be struggling with tire work. Yeah, they reeled him in here, wow. It's quite a... Starkey said yay. I don't know what he said yay about. <laughs> or yeah, yeah. Yay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so top four, very close here. Two seconds. Part as well, overtakes a little week probably will be uploaded uh, to, from Monte Carlo, will be uploaded soon. I've got to upload the F4 division first, that'll be uploaded tonight after this race, and then after that, overtakes of the week will be up as well. So there you go. Just a point out for anyone looking Half out for that. Oh, he might not keep that though. That Here comes Jock. Go Jock's going to go for Sean Bean as well, probably into turn one. He is. And he's there. And a slight contact, but Sean Bean's still going to be there. Well, Jock's still going for it with Sean Bean into turn three. He's going to back out of that one. Sean gives him the room just in case. It's a massive train. Oh, what glitch. Central. Uh, oh! What on earth happened? What on earth did happen? I was on board with Joe. I was. He was in the stands. He was. He went out of the track. He went. Oh, Ryan goes for a little bit of a lunge on Joe, but doesn't do anything. He was out of the stand. 
He went out of track. That was horrific. If you would like to quickly maybe yeah. invite him in because he's going to be annoyed. I want to see what happened. Maybe maybe we're just seeing lag, and or maybe that was just lag. Oh, that is. I mean, it's not me thinking there's a slight bit of lag in this lobby, but there must be if that's just going to happen. Jock, by the way, takes the lead now from Sean Bean and DRS straight. Oh, that was some massive lag, wasn't it? Wow, that was. I wonder what people on the stream are going to say about that. that Oh, Starkey's laughing his head off. Um, or oh, arse off, even. Oh, many, um, wow. Out now? Well, both of them being lagged now. That's two. Oh, well, he may have oh, yeah. been. Ooh, may have been three, actually. But I think all of them lag. Definitely happened uh, two weeks ago, in, or three weeks ago in Spain. But Jock in the lead. Wow, that's... That was... Oh, I didn't get the hit sound anyway, so... I don't mind it being missing because I didn't hear it. That was amazing. Wow. I'm in mean, um, complete shock about that, actually. That's... Really? Really shocking me. Quite. No, no, no words other than just lag has got to be the hundred percent reason that just happened. LGS pits. It was underneath the track. It was. Yep. Uh, he's uh, he's not willing to come. Well, he's not willing to stay and watch. Don't know if you're willing to join then. Ultrasofts for LGS. There's just no words to describe that, is there? That's just the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Is that Ryan's yeah, lost no, it? He the yeah, he's definitely lost a lot of time. I'm, I've got the best thing ever to send to Joe, probably. Don't be in keeping short. Yeah, he is now. Now he's been passed. He's on the pace of them, which is interesting. But uh, DRS, not really, he's not really close enough for DRS to be useful. I just came out in sixth, just ahead of Harris. I don't actually know. It's about eight, maybe it's a bit less in it because you missed turn one. So it might even be about 20. Yeah, 20, 20 no, it might, it might be less than that. Might even be less. Does he just come out of the pits, does he? Well, Sixteen seconds, about ish. I want to say. I think it might be less than that because Ryan was so far off on the leader after his slight spin. He might have been even two seconds off. <laughs> I'm not going to go on board with Felipe Massa's car. It's just a bit laggy on mine because he's all over the track in one foul swoop. I think it's just him just completely losing it. I don't know, it's weird because he's look his no, nah, I don't know, I don't know. Is it a, his car just is more in one straight line but at an angle. On, on on my screen it's not. It's just out it's just out of the front. He's in a straight line now. But it's weird how he swoops that he just swoops round. It's weird. No, I don't know. There's gotta be lag in this lobby though. We've just seen that crash from before. It's hundred and ten percent some sort of lag here. Oh. Penguin in the pits. Uh, there's a penguin in the pits. 
sort of soft will be a soft. So, the Adam vs. Adam battle is about to continue to happen, even after um, Adam pitted, so he's managed to catch up a pit stop, I believe, here. No, uh, this for, it's for no, a second one, no, surely. Top, top four haven't pitted. Have you not? Yeah. Have they really not? They've been battling this whole time. I don't think they've been that bad, they were spread, spread apart for a number of laps. And Adam again loses out, out of that, that, cor that corner. Looks like he's struggling for traction a fair bit. Um. Yeah, you're right, none of the top lot yeah. stopped. Interesting. Also, I think Adam's the last, well, our remaining starters on Super Soft. At some point during the stream, I have had drops of frames, so I have had a bit of lag. Sorry, people, um, for that one. Looks like Adam and, I, and Adam is, is like the only person who's strong and Joe has spread it. Up home is on his own. Sits on his own. So, yeah, so. Lag was. Definitely involved in that crash. I don't know, uh, um, but I don't know if Azar saw what we saw. <laughs> Into the last chicken. Uh, Adam Lou. Adam uh, Lou. Both Adam Lou lost oh it God. then. Sean Beans, by the way, in the pits. Now comes filing out. Oh, he's nearly lost it on the way out. He's coming out behind Ryan. Yep, behind Ryan. Ryan so. Jock continues on. Uh, oh, here goes Adam on Adam to the outside. Do it. That's a brilliant move if he can make it stick. Oh, and I no, he's still there. Adam's still there. That's amazing. And Ryan is right. And here comes him. Ryan. I think this Adam's got this in the end. Well, Ryan's gonna just pounce in a second. No, oh, he's gonna go. Actually, he's gonna go on Adam now. Oh no, we make it. That's a good move, though. Good defensive driving, everything. Good racing. Between two Adams, Ryan. I don't know if he meant to do that, but luckily it was a slight bit of contact, definitely. But no one spinning out. I can't remember. Jock has stayed out. Right, so Sean Bean just pit pitted in 15 seconds. That must be around. Oh. Pit, the, the pit well, stops. Adam number one has pitted. As Joe has liked his game clip of the crash, he's excited. Oh. That penguin then on the soft compound tyre. Adam pitted. Yeah, he did, yep. Yeah. First. One. So now it's be Ryan on Adam. It's about time. Yeah, it's Ryan on Adam and then Sean being just behind. Yep. Oh, slide on the exit of the corner. Ryan is on the back of Adam. He shall, should get him. Maybe. On DRS, he you would like to think. think about it. Adam goes defensive. Oh, that was very close, but nicely done. He just drove around the outside of him instead. Then didn't need the DRS to drive around him. Nah. Brian's not at the best you can at all, there, is he? He's gonna get away with it, I think. And thingy, thingy, pitted, pitted. Now they're into the lead of the race because Jock has pitted. Yeah. Comes out. And he comes out. Right Ooh, behind. just behind him. Oh, on softs. So here they were, what were they, behind him? About, yeah, 15, about 15, I think? They were the game. They were the game. Wow, so it's not a big pit stop at all, is it? 
Yeah, it's not a big pizza at all. Oh, deep for Adam, Sean Bean. He's gonna try and get him, Jock's gonna try and get involved. Sean's through, but here goes Jock as well. He's gonna try and pounce on it, and I think he's gonna, he has. Adam is now struggling on those super sauce. LGS is the next car to attack him. Adam's really helped bring an LGS really into the fray of things here. Uh, hello to Mr. Nobody as well on stream. Jock surely won't be able to get Sean Bean into turn one. Nope. I'd like, I'd like to say from doing a slot of one test session that the soldiers are still a lot better than the soft so it'd be interesting to see how well Jock does on these if you can keep with them to ahead of him I'd be shocked if he could it's a bit of a cut for a just big slide from Adam ahead of him he should get him here and he goes to the inside I knew it was close, but LGS, yep, nicely done. Up into fourth place. He's on the grass a little bit on the exit. Will Adam or Massa try anything into the hairpin? Nope. Oh, a bit deep, very deep from LGS. Better exit, though. And Sean Bean has got himself away from Phil. Adam versus Harris might happen. It's RG Matiz on the sauce. It's Fat Penguin on the sauce as well. Still have 11 drivers left. Alright then, so LGS must have made a mistake in the chicane because Felipe Massa is back by him in 4th place now. LGS back down to 5th. So, it's easy to make a mistake in swimming pool, but I definitely think there was one by LGS. Right. Masters managed to take these super soft tyres 20 laps. And they're definitely struggling now, so LGS has to do the work again after definitely making a mistake into or in the last chicane. That would be Tremiston. Here comes LGS. Nope, doesn't do it at the hairpin. Waits a little bit longer for the DRS. Alright, and LGS not able. Ooh, LGS pits. Interesting. Yeah. Adam now on Harris for fifth place into turn number one. Up the inside he goes, bit deep. Harris is still there. It's good racing, close action. Bloody hell, that's quick pit stops from LGS. Definitely maybe he got damage on those or something. But Adam now through past Harris. Passed him at turn one into fifth place. A good racing, very hard racing, both of them. So, not surprising, but getting to text Mazar, it does look like that real that incident was really caused just by cars going back and forward in in the lag, which is a problem that needs to be fixed. I don't know who's hosting this one again today. It doesn't happen in every division, but 
It's happened a quite a bit actually now in the F1 division. So they need that to be sorted. Oh, a tap of the wall by Nicole. And LGS is on Soss. Penguin versus Tremus here. Tremus on the ultra soft. I think Fat Penguin's gone to def I'm not sure if he's really gone to defend the inside or not there, but it doesn't, I don't know if it's actually going to matter by the time they get to the corner. Tremus is way ahead. That's the other Tremus to get inside the top 10. A jock, yep, definitely losing. Sean Bean, not shocked about that one. Adam or Fred Master still out there on Super Sauce for 22 laps now. We are not even halfway through yet. Sure. <coughs> Probably not a positive way to look at this race, yeah. but admittedly, I'm missing the fact that no, I can no longer hear sound. I forgot how depressing it is to do these with no sound. Harris, by the way, is in the pits from sixth place. It's really bad, by the way. I've got used to hearing the sound and hearing nothing. All I can hear this whole time is you. <laughs> Just think, you know. There's no car sound, it's really annoying not to well, hear the cars you, you when they're revving because it looks... Or, or is it them, or no, is it them just, just you. Like... No, no, I, the way I get it all set up, I can only hear you from my headset. Oh. So there's no echoes and nothing. That is right. it. That's... And it's funny because there's three things in front of me. I can see, I can see the stream three times, but I can't hear anything, so it's really frustrating. <laughs> Harris, by the way, came out in seventh. Because <laughs> you're hearing all the, you can see crashes and you should hear stuff. There's no vibrations as well, which really annoys me. Um, and there's no, you know, there's no sound with the crashes, no sound with the cars, uh, there's no revving, there's no. Uh, it's really. But Harris put in. is catching Lee on the ultra softs. Jess went on the softs and Harris went on the ultra softs. So interesting one here. And Harris should just, pits. when he gets to him, breeze past. Finally. Lee, he'll stay ahead of Lee, though. He's on the softs, yeah, he will as well. Really? On the, oh, oh, on the soft compound tyres. Oh, Nicole was just going into the last corner here. Is there a car in the last corner or anything? No, I can't see a car. Corner. How on earth has she... Oh, it's done a... Has she had your retard or did she... It was okay, it's... Damage. Well, she just looks like terminal damage because there's no front wheels on the front right there. Um, that's an interesting one because how'd you crash there unless you're doing a Massaro and um, Perez, I think it was, wasn't it? Terminal damage. So that's one car now down. She will not she stay with oh, zero like points so far this season. The grass and then just <sighs> up like a chicken. Maybe. Possibly. That is definitely a possibility. Harris is catching LGS. Sure. Yeah, this is where the battle will be at. The sauce may last a while, but it looks like they don't have that much grip. Compared to those worn two supers and then normal socks that Lee had, he didn't. He uh, he, he lost time. Yeah, so Harris will be charging at LGS, isn't it? Tremus in ninth. And a very slow moving RG. Oh no, RG's got a rear left puncture. Oh. And has to do the whole track with a rear left puncture. How? So he's, he's, he's hit basically where? Maybe he's nearly spun it at the last corner and then powered into the inside. And Unless it was. That's unfortunate. That was an interesting strategy on a soft the, there. Wait, one, two, after turn three. Ran a bit, bit wide and got. 
Yeah, boy, well, that's where I found him going slow, so he could have done it just before, yeah, definitely. Definitely could have been that one, so that's that's unfortunate for RG. He's 10th at the moment, we'll get a point if he just stays in the race. Yeah, there's, there's quite a lot. I thought there would be in Canada, especially with 100%, and now there's, there's absolutely loads. So RG is probably going to be lapped. Yeah, probably. At one point, he the was. The staying, staying for the leaders. Second, yeah, he didn't have the best start. It's going to be interesting him getting to the pits, I'm going to admit that one now. Because he has to come across the track with a puncture, so he's going to have to go slowly. I think there's a nice gap in the road for him to, yeah. There is a nice gap in the road. And he's into the pits now. Cool. RG will get 10th if he does finish. I assume he'll be for the softs. Ultra softs. Go on. Oh, my, f my screen's froze again. Oh, good thing, I managed to change it. Yeah, it doesn't look like that Harris can just catch up to the lead. Fortunate for the Oh, we lost it, bro. Way, way. Kicked out the wall. What a save. Sean's Amazing back. saves. Oh, no, we've lost Sean Bing, we've lost Sean Bing. Oh, let's go, Jaw, find him. Where is he? Where is he? He's back there. I see him. He's, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, um, I've seen he him. Must um, have lost it. I don't know. I um, don't know where he, how has he crashed there? Oh, his car's gone. Here, here it is, here it is. Uh, I'll tell you what. He has had a massive slide or something, hasn't he? Oh, yeah. uh, these are. That. Sean being out of the race, he's crashed halfway down this straight. He's on the right there, he would have been. Thing. He must have had a ma. Oh, he saved it and then unsaved it, obviously, yeah. isn't he, really? So, second place is out. The race winner last time out in Monte Carlo is done. He was keeping the pace with the leader of Ryan, but sadly dropped it in the wall. Well, that's a hopefully a game clip recorded situation. Mm -hmm. I don't think now, by the way, I can go on the game clips as well to have a look at them. I can actually do that during the race. So if anything, if there is a break in the action where there's nothing actually happening, where well, there's not really be much going on now, but there is a possible battle, so. It's Harrison Lee, but Harrison isn't catching, and uh, yeah. RG Matisse is... Oh, RG, oh, he's gone, I, he's I, it. I think, he's I gone think into turn like he's one, turn two. Sadly, OGS would get that, but I paused it, so I couldn't I see it in the background when that's happened. I won't concentrate on the background, because I was But he's out. So he won't get any points now. I think we're down to eight, are we not? I think we are. It's been a bit of a. I feel like we've fallen down to eight. We just randomly lost a couple of drivers in one. Oh. If you survive, you're doing well. It seems. Losing the same amount of people as we were losing in Monte Carlo. Yeah. <laughs> I know it's a straight back track, but I'm, just, I'm shocked that this is happening. Traction, of course, is awful around here, and no, and punctures is a bit terrible, but sure. didn't the expect the this. Has he just straight lined it? I didn't see him lose it. I, I can, I can categorically confirm that. I ain't got a clue. That's what I'll Ooh. tell you. I ain't got a scooby video. I'll look at it. Definitely a possibility that he's maybe got annoyed of getting a puncture or something. Here we go. What happened to Azar? Although I can only just hear the car. You can only just hear the car. Has anything really happened to Terry Lee? Of course, he couldn't make it today. Um, the thing that happened to Azar was um, lag. Basically, it was just there was a four-way battle for the lead, and it lagged, and it put him outside the track. Basically. Um, so uh, what else has happened really for you, Harry D? We've lost yeah. RG because of just he's had a bad race, and it seems like oh no, RG has now plopped it in the wall. Yeah. Um, and survived. Like wow. Got a bit of Fifth place, Harry. Um, not shocked really. 
So yeah, uh, Joe's out because of the lag. Um, we lost now RG. Um, we've lost Nicole and we've lost Sean Bean, which was it was, was second place, two seconds off the leader, when sadly dropping in the wall halfway down a straight. So yeah, interesting. A pole time was a 12.1 as well, just for you, Harry D. You might be interested in that one. So we're down now to eight drivers. Harry D currently fourth in the championship. So he won't be losing any points to the guy in third of RG. The person that's gained out of all of this would be Adam, who is currently fourth place on those soft tyres. I say which Adam? Adam. Adam. <laughs> they both the other Adam's third. Adam, Adam, Adam. They're both Adams gaining after all they're battling. I think it's actually Adam worked out pretty well for them. Take them 50 odd laps or 45. Well, he went 22, 20, 20 22, 25. 23 laps on the Super Soft, didn't he? 25, did he? Wow, so he's got to do what? How many? A bunch. He's got to do a. Ah, cool. uh, maybe. Maybe, because on 50%, those tyres can do that, can't they? 50 something laps. Six, I think. Yeah, because on on fifty percent we can do around about like twenty eight or more on them, I think, can't we? So if we can do that, he can most likely do. Oh no, he's dropped in the wall on my screen. He's he's cocked up the so we have the last yeah. chicane. I All don't right, so think he might have an end plate or something, but he managed to, we'll to clip the wall. LGS so by the way got pitted. Like I think he got lucky there, but I think it was in the wrong gear. He literally just slides and nearly head on with the wall. But LGS pitted, so that's a bit funny. Sean Bean has now sent me a message. Just need to think about damage settings, as I shouldn't have lost my will with that impact. We're on full damage, to be fair, Sean Bean. Every division runs it. The full damage is probably the best for. It's a lot better than simulation, trust me, you don't want that. And it's better than reduced or whatever because reduced yeah. is terrible. Yeah, no so, unfortunate for you, Sean. Maybe if you've got a clip of that, would be cool. We'll see how bad the contact actually was because I'd probably agree that the car probably only tapped it. But LGS comes out in seventh place on Ultra Softs. Jock's leading because Ryan has pitted on. To the super uh, onto the soft compound tire and comes out in second ahead of Adam 1509. Oh. I'm gonna quickly go on the phone and check if we can see any game clips of this race so far because if we can, we can quickly nip to it. Well, if anything's not going on, we've still got a Harris versus Massa. Yes, realistically, Tremus has actually found himself in sick for the moment. Has, has. Ooh, see if Ryan can close Jock now. Jock's the first, right? Okay. Yeah, but see, see if Ryan can close him down now. Because Jock might be going to the end of the race. So he's on the softs, of course. Interesting one. Ryan definitely will be. I think from now, isn't he? It tastes like a gap. Soft tires. Got a clip of Azor's one, so quickly have a look at that on my phone. So if I see anything, I'm gonna be looking at it. Um, watching the hard, aggressive racing that there is between a lot of them, really racing hard. Adam or, Adam or it's a little bit close, it's a little bit close. Oh, no, bloody. <laughs> I have no idea what happened with that crash. Let me just watch that again. Clarification. We're almost halfway through. We're fast forwarded to about there. We're almost. Fast forward, yeah, come on, fast forward this clip a little bit. I just want to see that crash again, because that's weird. What? Right, weird crash. So Harris versus Jeff Master is just sort of driving around, aren't they? They're not getting close to each other or anything. Um, Ryan 
definitely closing jock down but nothing's gone on there just yet um, yeah. I will get that clip up then for you in a second 20 29 minutes ago that clip so I'll get it up soon Adam is definitely driving away from Harris we'll quickly jump to that that clip Uh, so this should allow me to. Let's have a look quickly of this clip. Here we go, full screen clip of the incident on board with Azar. This is the hard racing between Jock and Sean Bean just ahead. They're rubbing tyres. Very close all around now into this turn three. You see, it gets a little bit bunched up. A little bit close because they're trying not to hit each other and then through it. And here's the little bit of lag. Boop, do, do, uh, oh. So I don't have a clue what Joe was going to do in that situation. And we're back to the race. So that was that crash. Ooh. I don't know. I don't know. Adam Banana. So yeah. Talk about that one on the stream. I don't actually have a clue. Where is Azar? It says um, XRL PS4 Live. But I'm guessing that might be Bernie. Bernie. He's out of the race, so hopefully, I think you may have just missed that clip I just showed of his crash. Adam had a front wing change, so he will be behind Adam and Harris. He is on the tyre that I just use up on some tyres. Softs. Softs for you. Um, yeah, he's out of the race after lag. And big, big race for fourth. I don't know if you just got here in time for the clip there, Bernie, but if you didn't, it's on his yeah. feed. Right. Lag and uh, Azar had nowhere to go, really. Couldn't really avoid that lag at all. And sadly, he's out of the race at zero points. Um, So we know that Harris. Yeah, Sean Bean not too happy. Again. Did I his crash? Yeah, he most likely has too. He hasn't been able to get past Massa yet. Ryan closing Jock down bit by bit. So, Trim. Remus on the super stuff, so... Yeah, I think so, yeah. I don't know what strategy he is doing, to be fair. I think it's his third... Wait, I, I don't know how... Is he really? He's pitted... At least pitted three times every single time for the ultra softs. Mm. No lie. He went onto the softs for a brief stint of... Yeah, he didn't go on it for long, did he? It was a weird one. For the ultra yeah, very brief stint. Adam is catching Harry and Adam. Adam has very. Yeah, Harris hasn't been able to get past it. He's not been able to make the most of these tyres. If Adam is going to play again, I assume it'd probably be around lap 16. Yeah, I just thought about Adam closing up. He's very close. <laughs> Close very quickly. Ryan continuing to close the gap to Jock in the lead. These two are the top two in the championship by 11 points. Top two in this race at the moment. First place in the championship is out of the uh, race. That's the first time. Fourth isn't here and I fifth is a bit Adam better. the last one came and not go sideways out, out of it. Yeah. Really? On sideways out of turn two, though. Could be a uh, fun track tomorrow, I'm going to admit. Um, a bit difficult. It'll probably rain tomorrow, so. Um, Walls are close. Yeah, most importantly, rain, yeah. Be exciting. Watch GB2 tomorrow live on XI Racing Week. No, it's not even that anymore, isn't it? XRL F1 Live. Watch it. Live. XRL F1 Live. GB2 Division. You send them to the one that is not used anymore. 
Well, it can be used for the stewards that want to. By the way, the XRL PS4 Live is now live. Well, the, the account's now live, so go follow that if you want to watch the PS4 side of things for Project Cars and F1 Racing will be there soon as well. And like I said before, Overtakes of the Week will be uploaded after the F4 race, uploaded after this stream tonight. Well, about three hours after the stream, the F4 stream will be up, and then it's about one. check back tomorrow morning. You will have the F4 and Overtakes of the Week uploaded. I can now, tell you that one because F4 might have to be uploaded during the night. Fourth for close, third, fifth, and fourth. Yeah, I muddled them up. You got it right. Yep. Yep. You got now. Use your. Oh, did you? Did you get them all? I think you nailed it. I'm gonna say this in the pits. It says teammates in the pits. Uh, Vitrius. Very close now. Harris has dropped off the back of Adam, and it's Adam on the back of Harris now. Oh, Harris has gone deep. And that is nice. Or is it Austria? Have to say that Adam 105, 1509, even 1509 is the guy for overtakes. He just, he, I know that one was a mess up by Harris, but he's good with the overtakes. I'd have to say. Next week, Austria or Baku? Which one is next it? week? Um, Baku. Baku. I, I, the the other tour Russell driver should should be back for next week. Andy for Andy. And, and where's you've just come online? Did oh, you have? I have had some lag during the stream, so apologies to people if you've seen lag. It says I've dropped 107, 109, 179 frames this during this stream. So you wouldn't, might hopefully there would have been lag here and there, not all the time. But it's a live stream, lag happens. Whoever you are. And you have perfect connection. Yeah, like that. Yeah, even for certain companies, big collaboration companies have lag, so yeah. That happens. Now, Adam's on the back of Adam again. He's actually for a podium position now as well. Ryan continues to close down the lead. LGS now currently in sixth, Primus in seventh on the softs going to the end. Alright. <coughs> Harris has dropped back a bit. It just seems like how much. Alright, incidents, just want to see. Adam's um, on the back of Adam. Trimus got a dry. Oh, right. This is why Trimus' race hasn't gone. Smoothly, because that too he got he pitted and he got speeding in the pits lane drive through. So Adam has just um, Adam so. passed. Yeah, really? I think it just goes Adam so much faster. So it's just what's the point? Right, I'm not I'm not keeping up with all these penalties, but there's quite a few, may I add. Of warnings Where's coming this out. Who's the host? You should know this. Uh, I think LGS. Brackets. I don't know. Question mark. More of a, more of a question than a statement. That one for me though. I believe it's. Yeah. So yeah, there's a few few warnings in this race, a few penalties. So there you go, just lap. I did that on lap 40 for you. So you can have a look at lap 40 for half of the penalties. Harris in the pits. Oh. You put heart frames, you put heart frames. Thanks. Thanks I just have to say goodbye to my relative. Just, just, 
Yeah, I don't know, know like you know, like math. Um, yeah. The jokes will lead by five point eight seconds now. Think, yeah, it's been the gap is coming down. But we'll grind tires and off. It's gonna be a good race here. By the time he catches. Oh, it's actually pulled out a little bit. Um, yeah, I don't know if Jock's going to the end or not, but Ryan definitely is. I guess we know it's probably not going to the end. We don't, we don't know going to the end. if Adam's going to the end unless he pits for ultras off some of the blood. Yeah, we don't either. Yeah. That's why I feel like Jock might do, because he's got the gap to further pit for ultras off and go for it oh, right. at the end. Mm -hmm. I feel like that might be a... How much are you up? I suppose if Jork pits, it would. Then Ryan has the thing of. of Doesn't it? If Jork pits, if he, he would pits be for quicker. Super, say, 10, yeah. minutes before the end, Ryan would have the conundrum of does he pit and then pass or stay out? Yeah, on exactly. Very, very one time. Strategy game, really, for the winner, isn't it? Yeah. Strategy game all up and down the field. Fat Penguin is currently sitting there in eighth place, gonna pick up four points. He continues as he is. Nearly getting that now. Jock's actually closing in. Uno go Trey. Atro. Ooh. I um, well I can say that Jock's going going to have ten seconds onto his time as well. So I could count. <laughs> so that's why it's laggy. Give us Scott the host, says uh, Mr. Nobody. Yeah, exactly. It could. Well, there's a um, there's a few bits of lag. There's definitely you know, cars jumping from the clip I saw. With definitely a few cars jumping back and forward. At so this it just doesn't moment look. In time, if Jork mm -hmm. wants to win, he'll have to eke out a 10 second gap. Oh, has he got? He has five. Enough, has he? Got ten wins. Oh. Five penalties are definitely ten, and Ryan's got. Three. Well, I think he's got like two, three. two penalties. Uh, three, yeah, three. Oh, so there. there what about um, anyone else getting big penalties? Oh, Who's there? Oh, yeah, here we go. Adam has a one, two, three, four. Adam has four. This is Adam yeah. one. Five oh nine, right? Has one, two, three, okay. four, five, six, seven. Seven. That's that. That's that. Seven. What? Seven. That at least a fifteen second that's is it not penalty? Twenty one. That's twenty. Lee has one, two, three, four. Well, if you get five, if you get five penalties. Ten, if you get ten warnings, it's a penalty. If you get five more, then Harris it's has a clean slate. He has he hit a fifteen. Harris has one more. Has one warning. Remus has. Oh, what on Harris? Wow, one, that's amazing. Two, two penalties. That penguin. Good, good. So one. three for Massa then. Sure, if he's got, you're saying he's got three. seven. I think I said. I think it's a twenty-second penalty. Then yeah, that's surely. I think surely uh, Mass has at least got a fifteen. Yeah, I, I, th I think because if you get if you get ten warnings, you get ten seconds. If you get five more warnings, you get fifteen. So he's got at least six more warnings, hasn't he? Do you want me, do you want me, there, do you want so me, that's do you want me to count? Time. I'll count all the war, all the war. Right, so one, two, three, four, yeah, seven, eight, eight, nine, twelve. Uh, I mean eleven, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 18, 19, 21, 22. Oh, another 25? Wait, I think he just got another penalty. Let me check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Right, he's. Just to clarify, you're not counting the word, no, the actual penalty no, itself, right? Cool, cool. Right, so well, that's I quite think a... he's nearing disqualification at the moment on the track. On the, yeah, maybe. <laughs> how many penalties is that? So he's got how many warnings? Twenty-five. Eight penalties. I think. I think. <sighs> well, that's I think at least a t that's know, definitely know, a twenty then, isn't it? I think it's X rail. Um, that's X -rail rules is, I think thirty, and you and you get dis dis disqualified. Yeah. 
Yeah. Really? So he's, he's definitely game, five more warnings away from getting disqualified from us. Okay. Holy cow, okay, so... I wow. I uh, the money here, like, I don't know how many... I don't know. How, how, how are you getting many penalties? Stop corner going. Well, you said stop corner going, Mr. Petronas, but... Uh, Mr. Petronas, Mr. Nobody, but, um... Easy to do, around this track. But, blimmin' hell, I didn't think it would be... That, I, I, I can understand getting three, maybe even four penalties worth, but... That many? Most, <laughs> nah. Most of them didn't, were, at didn't were in the first in. Same mo I say most of them. Really every first single in, one no. except for. Um, oh, he's well, I have a look at the recent thing. He's got nine now. Oh my. Wait, what's that? 27 <sighs> more. Alright, he's, 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 he's three away. Oh, he's gone. Oh, sugar. Unless, unless it's tired, in, so unless another position it, in, could in, be coming. Unless in. his tires are stupidly worn, he's just trying to, and he's just overcompensating for, for it and the corners, or, or it's just. Well, that fourth place might fall away from him if it continues. Oh, yeah. There, pretty sure it has. Lee's uh, ten, uh, just under ten seconds behind him, so. Yeah, he's only, yeah, he's not even that far off, of course he has, yeah. Will <laughs> he stop again? Oh, he has, and he's been on those ultra shots for a while. Stop again? How many times do you want to stop in one race? Well, he's going to have to stop again. I guarantee that. Oh. It looks like that Adam has a... Um, Cleaned himself up for. Um, he's had none, no warnings this lap, so congratulations to him. <coughs> yeah. Really? Right then. This, the gap is under four seconds now to the lead. Is Ryan going to get there? He keeps bringing it, bringing it down. Uh, ha ha Harris is in. Si yeah, you said about OG is pitting. Yeah, he's just come out of the pits now on the softs. <laughs> so he's going to the end of the race now. But he's come out in seventh place. Oh. He's just got Tremus ahead of him, so a battle for sixth will be on possibly. Tremus is also on soft, but more worn, so battle could be on that. Uh, oh, host migrating. Is host migrating. Who's the host? That, was it Fat Penguin? So it's not LGS as the host because that means he would have been gone. Because Fat Penguin is ghost. So it was a Fat Penguin that was the host then? Yeah, Fat Penguin's the host he then. Ghost. So it wasn't LGS. Sorry about that. It wasn't the Scottish man as the host. So it was Fat Penguin. And Fat Penguin, 8th place, we won't be getting 8th place points anymore. We did last week. <laughs> Two, really. Wow. So we have 7 left. Why has LGS put it 4 times? I don't know. That'll have to talk to you. <laughs> that that general question that unless is nobody. Uh, general answer, we have no unless, idea. Unless he's <laughs> gone for the softer strategy, because then it gives you no super softs. That's all I can think of. Yeah, but you would have thought, because he, he went on those softs earlier, didn't Might he, but only for like nine laps. Might not have thought the softs would have. You would have thought then he would have stayed on them. Three I think he may have tapped the wall and lost his front wing or something. Well, he lost. I think maybe he lost a part of his front wing. Maybe. Maybe that's why he then pitted. Yeah, the fact that he pitted onto Super Ultra Softs twice probably wasn't twice. the best. Three times. So maybe he thinks it was. Three times, man. Quite a few. Quite, quite a few. Three times stopped. Four. And 
He has got a good run and three miss for six. To the inside. Goes for it. His car's half of the way with a little bit of contact. And then Katrina's has gone deep and LGS up the inside now. And that is a done move by LGS. No. Into sixth place. Miss Harris. Five seconds down, down already. He's lost a lot. He pitted, didn't he? Fatman's car continues to drive round. Sure. That's the gap then. It stayed the same since the last time I saw them. It's still 3.8 for the lead. 20 plus to go. So at the moment, it looks like Oh, Trimus nearly dropped it in the wall then on the exit of the last corner. Very easy to do. Very. The gap for the lead has actually just gone back above four seconds. Interesting Inside knowledge. No, yeah. for that one. I, uh, my sources are telling me that Adam isn't nearing disqualification on the game. Isn't? Isn't? Yeah. Really? And he. Okay, when, when is disqualification? He it's so random. And then he said he's not corner cutting every corner. Right. <coughs> Okay, how are you getting that? How are you being told I that? I have sources. I have inside sources. Use your brain, Wes. He might not be cutting every corner, but he's definitely heading toward a big penalty of about 20 seconds. Because how many warnings has he got now? Let me count again. 1, 2, 4, 7, 8, 9, 11, 13, 14, <laughs> 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 21, 22... 25, 27. This is 27 to get. 25, 27 warnings. That's at least a 25 second XRL penalty. Yeah. So, yeah. No, not nearing disqualification, but a bit of a, a, bit, of, a bit of a pen. Yeah. I'm pretty certain that might put him behind Harris or LGS well, here. you know. Yeah. Just a small bit of a penalty. Oh, not, not, not big one. Maybe. Right, is there any bat? I don't know. The other Adam. One five oh nine. Currently just driving around in third place. Good race from him currently. Currently seventh in the championship. We'll move past. It stayed like this, Sean Bean in the championship up to 5th place, so uh, not mine, 6th place, he's going to be 7th, so they move up to 6th. It stayed as it was, or is. Oh, yes, he's only 10th in the championship, wants some actual points at some point this season, got 18, but that's it, had quite a few incidents and crashes and just unfortunate things happen so far this season. Can we get... Can we... disqualify everybody? Says Harry D. Nope, sadly not. Well, if they get a bit... If suddenly everyone gets a bit worse, maybe. <laughs> so then you don't lose any points in the championship. You're fourth. And of course, the two leaders are the two that are ahead of you, of Jock and Ryan. So probably not the best bet for you, maybe. As well, RG's ahead, but RG didn't, hasn't got any points here today. So, you'll stay behind him at the same amount of points. 
Now LGS, big slide, but he's on the back of Harris. For fifth place, big ten points. It's a nice place to get fifth. Big slide from LGS. Ooh, what a save. It's a massive slide. Ryan's in the lead, Jock has pitted then. On that last lap, Jock has pitted for Ultrasoft. He's 11 seconds behind Ryan, which pits. So there you go, that's a tactic and a half. Get close to him, he decides to pit, then you follow him in, so then you... That's smart, I would have probably done the same thing. It's a race between the top two on Ultrasoft now. So Ryan will be on his left. Jock probably just gone back into the lead of this race. We jump back onto Ryan, here we go. Comes out now, yeah, Jock in the lead. Now it comes Ryan, the gap is around 3 seconds. By the time he gets back onto track it might be around about 4, but the top 2 are going to have a big old race for first place. It's Jock leading by then Harry, then Adam in third place. And then other Adam decides that pitting is the better option in fourth place. I think that might make other Adam pit. That might make third place Adam pit for some ultra sauce. Because that's what everyone seems to be doing, Ultrasoft to the end. LGS has just passed Harris for fourth place, most likely then with DRS. Sadly not able to see it. So Massa will come out behind Trimus actually in seventh place, so he's gonna have to pass a few cars. Definitely gonna have to pass quite a few cars here. Just now into fourth and definitely going to the end. Interesting to see if this Adam pits. Great. We're about to be, well, we've definitely put the leaders, I believe, would have crossed the line to go on to lap 55 now. But Adam at the moment oh, is on 54. close enough with DRS this time round I'd have to say. Other Adam didn't pit. Did that, Adam just clunked the wall, looks like he got away with it if he did. Oh yeah, slightly deep through turn one there. The best line in the world. Big big slide from Trimus it looked like in sixth place. Continues on, he definitely gets some good solid points of 7th place, which is 6 points. Nice, solid finish after having a drive through at the start. Let's jump on to see how close the leaders are. It's 3.2, the gap. That one might get a bit close, but for sixth place, this is where the battle is at. Should be the fast charging Fleeper Massa coming through the pack here. Maybe carrying quite a few penalties now with corner cuts, but needs to get that gap really. Sorry about that absence. So, yeah, a bunch of pit stops oh, that happened. Okay. The top two um, Jock pitted, which made Ryan pit for Ultra Soft. Yeah. Uh, sure. Fleeper Massa pitted then for. <laughs> Ultra soft as well, and he's now at the back of the pack, coming trying to come he's through the field. Yep, he's going to want to try and get the gap as well. well he's that big gap. Well, so it's not taken on to the next race. It needs to be ahead of one car. Yeah, but if he wants to get those valuable points, he's going to want to try and get the gap. Go. He's going to get past one car, you would think. Oh, not able to. Haven't got a lot fresher and faster tyres than Trinus. Can do. He's currently sitting seventh. Right, somehow he's racked up 30. Right. That's, that's I wonder the rules in XRL are exactly Jordan. about that, but that's at least at least the 25, isn't it? <laughs> to clarify the rules for you. Yeah, if you want to clarify. 
the quote out ones, yeah. I'm just pulling right. away now from her. So my so my sword, just my, ahead. my sources are telling me one more my, one oh, more big slide one, for one the both of them. Morning, Who is telling you this? Where's usual brain? I certainly don't know who's telling usual you this. Because they'll just still driving. It wouldn't be Lee, would it? Oh, no, but I'm just saying it. How many warnings do you need to get to get disqualified? Says Mr. Nobody in the game. God knows. In the, in the game, there. In XRL. We will clarify soon. There is. Clarify soon. So um. Is Bernie telling you that? No. Who is telling I'm you that? This is a nice cutback by oh he's I'm getting, gone off I'm the road. Sources from inside the Felipe Massacre. All right. How do they know? So is that are you have you gone and clarified the uh, rules then? I'm just about to. On the forum. All right. Because it's a bit weird, I understand it's 10 seconds and then it's 15 and that lot, but when it gets to this high, I don't actually know where they draw the line. And the leading gap is a little bit bigger now, Jock has pulled away from Ryan, as they're on the same tyres. Here we go, Massa might have a good run on Tremus here, he goes to the outside. And we'll try up the inside now. He goes for it, makes the corner, yes, and into sixth place goes Felipe Massa. Big, big slug out of the corner, dodges the wall, so it's all good. He is into sixth place. On the track, anyway. Oh, big side. It's not a nice save. Be in here, then I think it's in there. I want to say it's in there. Uh, league rules and regs. Here we are. <coughs> please note these are provisions. I mean, I'm, I'm assuming if they, I'm assuming they've been treated right. So, so. Okay, all right. No, so uh, coming through the field as Massa at the moment is now oh, on the back of Harris for fifth, and that is that. I think that's the move down. That's a brilliant sort of switch back on Harris. It's so much better of grip than Harris, and Massa up to fifth place. He's passed two of them very quick, well, decently quickly, and we'll now charge after LGS. It's like halfway in it. Gaps bring the ball a little bit further back down now by Ryan. They're matching each other by the top two. First and second in the championship. See, because they've changed, I can't clarify them. Do you know? No. Well, it should be like halfway through, or maybe it's even at the bottom as a little add on. Let me get my. Uh, let me uh, contact some sources and I'll uh, get back to you. Contact yeah, Bernie. That's, that's not good. <laughs> Bernie's the man. Uh, man of the plan. Hi to Stocky and hi to Nicole on the chat. Randomly. Right. Stocky was once again adding hi. My controller batteries are low. Right, well, we're gonna. Oh god. We're quickly gonna shove uh, my battery back on. Two seconds. Mm -hmm. Liam fourth. Adam third. Ryan. Short even the gap to Ryan. Of about three seconds. Oh. Right. Back 
into my account. And we're back. Oh, there you go. And we're back. Oh, in the wall. In the wall on my screen, but it looks like no damage done. Possibly own plate damage is massa. Out of the wall, right at wall of champions. But, um, yeah, no, no damage seems to be done to the car. Cool. Primus is actually caught on Harris there for six. That's a legit battle that could go down. Oh, big slide from Ryan. What save though? Look at that. Amazing save. Primus is, is now Just a bit more time. Adam is now fifth, so he's passing Harris as well. Yeah, passing. Yeah, he's trying to chase down LGS. Just to be safe, he probably needs to get about a 20 second gap. No. Yeah, I would as well, yeah. If you want those points. Gets it out. End of the race, seven places there. I know that you get if you get a ten and then you get if you get ten warnings then you get ten seconds. If you get another five warnings after that it's fifteen and it goes up from five, so, so I, that's why I know. But I don't know how high it goes right, at this so, point. So obviously you take the Ryan so Pitts from second place. On to Walchersoft, that's interesting. Why is Ryan is Ryan Given up maybe on the win here and just gone alright, I'll take second or is there some damage for that car? Well there's not he's not reset, so he's not got a front wing change. Or anything like that. So Ryan maybe it's just didn't look like a puncture or anything, so Ryan might have just played that safe and gone for a second place. As Adam's trying to survive in third place to LGS here. Asset is coming for him. Oh, he was disqualified. Alright. Took his time. He's been disqualified. Uh, so, uh, zero points then for him when we're down to. Uh, we just wor worked out how many corner cuts your warnings you need then. It's round 30. <laughs> so, um, round that. And it's now. We've now. Down to six drivers gonna finish here. And uh, we've got a fight for fifth between Harris and Tremus. For fifth place, there's yellow flags out for Adam's car, but it's alright. An actual battle for fifth on the track, 10 points here. Tremus' is first race trying to get the 10 points. Harris currently in fifth in the championship. It's a good finish either. It's 10 or 8 points either way here, as long as they can keep it on the road. Who's that further ahead of them? LGS is going slowly. They've just passed LGS. It's just puncture. Rear left puncture for LGS. Um, I don't know how he's clipped that, but he has. So LGS has got a rear left puncture down to sixth place. So now that fight between Tremus and Harris is for fourth. Oh, no, 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 no. What a save. Best what a save by Tremus. Investigation into disqualifications, but it depends. Ah, investigation. So, like, say, so, so like, say, Harris sadly like, went slowly through the chicane so you, there, so say, and Tremus went up the back of him. So, say you lost time on like 10 or like 10, 10, 10, 10 off of him, and obviously they'll take 10 off and all that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, well, not much. So, Tremus. Wait, did Ryan? Went up the back of Harris through the chicane because yeah, Ryan Pitt. Yeah. Yeah. Because um well, I think he's just playing it safe. So Tremus went up the back of Harris then in the last chicane and luckily just it was not luck, skill kept he just kept that out of the wall somehow. Fantastic job by Tremus, but they continue to fight for fourth place. The Red Bull has been lapped. Wow, Mr. Nobody said wow and Starkey said oh. <laughs> what is that in the response? Uh, possibly 
the disqualification. It was it was coming. Well, at least it's definitely was going in. Well, at least it's at a track renowned for corn cutting and not and not at a track like bloody. No. Bad Baku. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So this has gone from a fight for fifth to a fight for fourth. Twelve points instead of ten. Still a good result for Trimus in his first race to get fifth place here. Do you have any information on the next Mercedes man um, boss? Nope. Oh yeah, with the arrow, it's all a bit deep, and here goes Tremus. Oh, this is Kane, that's an amazing run. Good defense for Harris. Yeah, they're both Sam's, they're, they're both Mercedes and GP2. A little cut back here. Yeah, by Tremus, can he get the run on Harris now with DRS as well? Into the last corner, here we go for fourth place. He's got a few more laps to do it. The race is definitely on between these two. He's not going to make it this time around. He's definitely quicker than Harris at the moment. You'd have to say. And it's close between the two of them. Oh, there might have been slight contact there, but Trimus keeps his car facing the right direction. So it's a 21 second gap then. So Ryan did just decide to play it safe in second. To um, I'm being told first. that a lot of the warnings in the first like lap, like first thing was or laps, was him just trying to avoid people. Uh, that's unfortunate. And he said he, and he, said he, he was fine for, for about 20 laps, and then it just went to pop. Yeah, it's just easy doing it. It's just Just happens. I believe Plump last doesn't look like he's going to gain about. Plump last, but getting six points, so eight doesn't points. Look like he's going to gain okay. about half a minute in four laps. No, no I don't think so. Either. Once again, into the last game now. Harris versus Primus. They are all over the shot for this. Fourth place, it's two extra points. Harris sort of goes to the middle of the road, defensive hold the middle of the road. Oh, it's very close once again. Can Trimus drive on the outside of Harris? Unfortunately, not. That uh, drift of both of them just flying across the track, trying to save the car. Oh, Trimus is just all over the back of Harris. He's nailing, ooh, ooh, he's nailing the corners, just managing. He's going for it. Nice little defensive move by Harris, but. Dreamers getting the room, trying to find the room, trying to make the room, not able to make enough room there. Harris defended brilliantly in the great attack by Dreamers by trying that. Trying to catch Harris off guard, wasn't able to do it. He's all over the back of him. Some hard racing between these two. Keep it on the road, they've got some nice double figure points. Dreamers actually make at the moment would jump up quite nicely in the championship in his first race here he'd join the trio he'd make a trio with Hydra and uh, Azar on 10 points if he finishes where he's at I don't even think I've got 10 points yet <coughs> don't surely finished two, no. two, two here we go this is it Trimus now up the inside of Harris into the first corner this surely is it into turn one Harris is still there Still there, Trimus, there's a slight bit of contact, they sort of, sort of squeeze each other out a little bit, well, Trimus sort of squeezes Harris out at the end of it, spinners. but Trimus is through, at least there was, luckily there was no spinners there, definitely, it's a very close rating, and a little bit of an aggressive move at the end of it, into turn two, sort of squeezing him on the kerb, but Harris may be slightly annoyed with that, but at the same time now they're having to get out of the way of Jock coming through, lapping them. Jock is on the penultimate lap, by the way, on lap 69 out of 70. So Harris won't be really too annoyed with fifth place here. You'd 
have to say. Fine hasn't even been closing in on a uh, Jock on this stint. He's just sort of been cruising around. I think he's now 23 seconds behind. So, so. my maths tells me. Let's help Jock just in case he does have any penalties. Jock will have 20 seconds. Three minutes. He has 20 more than He has 20 seconds, yeah. Jock. So the fact that Ryan pitted, Ryan, he would, if he just stayed out there, maybe Ryan stuck with him, he could have got the seconds. win. Yeah. Oh. Didn't think that one through, did he? Last lap now for Jork. So Jork, even with the penalties of the 20 seconds, could actually come to the winner. Oh, if maybe if Ryan knew that. Oh, interested. Interesting. Interesting how happy Ryan would be if he heard that. Maybe he might have a really good reason for why he did have to pit, though. No, you are, because you're, you're no. the guest. That's how it works. Yep. Might have done this. That's how it works. The gap is 23 seconds, so he's not <coughs> getting to him, is he? And the rest are just very far back. Very much has been lapped, so he'll finish this lap as well. Adam's done well, Adam, Adam 1509 in third, just sort of driven around, fuel. done well. Very high. <laughs> and probably tired, and probably tired life, maybe. He just probably doesn't want to ruin any, any more than he can, because he's been on them for quite a while. Jock, he is the current championship leader of 101 points. He's 20 seconds ahead, and he might have a 20 second penalty, so he's done well here. He's going to move on to stay in the leaders' championship, have 126 points. Jock wins in Canada. Good race by Jock. He had that very much under control. Not from the start, though. He had to work for that one. Ryan. I don't know what his reasoning for putting was, but he's going to go across the line together with his teammate in second here. Um, in stereo. Second place for Ryan, he's second place in the championship. He has stayed there. He's now on 108 points. LGS getting sixth place there, eight points. So him finally moves up in the championship standings. Adam, last one to cross the line, because fourth place was Tremus making his debut and then it was Harris which is fifth in the championship gets fifth here so he gets some nice solid points right but Adam 1509 oh, will take third very nicely controlled third did exactly what he needed to do Adam takes third seventh in the championship will move up in the championship it's a good was ah doesn't matter actually it doesn't matter about the penalty 10, 20 second penalty because yeah. look at the penalties they all had quite a bit yeah yeah I know that's so, why they, they, they all the had best. the same penalties oh so Tremus goes behind Harris here then wonder if he's actually got 10 seconds ooh but it's Jock Ryan Adam Harris Tremus LGS we need to check if Tremus Harris has actually got oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Yeah, I want to know if Tremus has a... Uh, uh, one, three, four, five, uh, six... Uh, I recorded them all. They're on stream, so... But it looks like he may have more than ten warnings, so that might be actually a fourth place to Harris. But first was Jock, then Ryan, and then Adam. Mm. Oh... It's funny they don't have to tick no. the box anymore. <coughs> don't even have to tick it anymore, so you're all good. <laughs> have fun. Of that first stint, you end up coming in second place, been in the lead on that soft stint. How, uh, how was the race? Eventful. Well, the first. Uh, I think it was quite time. uneventful. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I, well, once everything started itself out, yeah. But the first um, 
a few laps as, uh, as everything was going on. I think I was in a, I was battling with Azar and he ended up going into the wall somewhere. I hope that wasn't my fault. Black. And apart from that, yeah, well, yeah, Ryan mentioned that as well. He was liking a bit when I was behind him. Um, after that, it was when I was on the softs, it was just keeping in touch with um, Ryan and Sean at that point. He was still in the race. I was always... <laughs> I'm about disconnected anyway. Right, I'm back. Um, and then at the end, it would have been very interesting if Ryan didn't uh, crank his front wing. But uh, that's the way it goes. Actually, I, I, I had a, a damaged front wing for that whole race because on the first lap, I just nudged. The uh, airs are on the first lap going to the last UK. He broke a bit earlier than I was expecting. I just touched him the slightest touch. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> game, game be like. That was an interesting story, John, but. <laughs> he doesn't like it. We might as well move on then. On a Ryan. Side fifth. Ended, ended second. Could have won with maybe a different strategy or just not knocking your wing. Maybe. How was the race? How was it from was your I, point of view? The first stint was eventful. They had all about five of us bunched up, but then once everyone had disconnected or smashed up, we had another two horses, but our soft tyres weren't lasting, and then we kept racing for the race. Yeah. On them. <coughs> well, Adam, quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Very. <laughs> Adam, you finished uh, third overall. It seemed like quite yeah. an eventful race. Well, the first um, first stim was definitely very eventful. Um, started. Seventh, I think, or sixth, can't remember. Um, I was following John and Ryan through um, at the start, and then seemed to have a bit, uh, a bit of a straight line, de the speed deficit compared to some others. Um, I got caught out in the DRS zones, uh, so I dropped back a bit, and then I lost half my front wing. Um, so I opted to replace that, which cost me six seconds, hoping that it had improved my pace, but. Um, it didn't, as it turned out. So I was, I was hoping and praying, um, be, be, like ended up having ended up third, um, 20 laps from the end. I was hoping that that wouldn't have ended up costing me the podium. Um, but then, um, LGS uh, ended up uh, ended up having a puncture actually, which was a bit of a strange incident. Um, but yeah, uh, my summary would be very, very exciting first in lots of battles. Um, hectic start, and then from then on, it was just completing the strategy with uh, no one else around really. It was kind of a bit of both exciting and boring. All right, so oh, Ryan's connecting, disconnected. It's helpful. All right, so for the remaining two, since Ryan's connecting, just views on next race. Baku, how you think yeah, and how well you think you'll do? I think we're both really looking forward to Baku. Um, it's a it's a track we both like. Um, so we're hoping we can keep up the good good record for Renault. Um, yeah, it should be should definitely be an interesting one. Yeah, big fan of Baku. Love it. Especially turn eight. <laughs> Tanner to everyone. Any, anyone who um, manages to get an overtake done at turn eight, I'll give them a tanner. They win a separate championship. <laughs> give them a hundred points. Well, 
the championship. Where's anything else you want to say before you wrap it up? Um, no, it was actually decent. Seventy laps. God, kill me. I'm not. Luckily, I'm not doing it tomorrow. Tomorrow um, should be happy days. Yeah, thank God for that. Lucky for some. And the next day and the day after that as well. Um, yeah, lucky for, yeah. <laughs> unlucky for some, lucky for some. Um, less finishes, I think, here than uh, Monte Carlo as well. That's well, we quite interesting. Stat, quite a weird stat, help. though. Yeah, yes, that, that, that definitely didn't help. But, um, yeah, it's a strange one. Strategy was all over the place from a lot of different angles, so that's, that's definitely what to look out for throughout the week. Um, other than that, it's a pretty good race, so... Different way of streaming. Hopefully that works nicely because it's how I'm going to probably be doing it more because that's how it Bernie wants us to anyway. Um, I've now got a message from LGS, so this could be an interesting conversation I've got to do after the stream. But yeah, so thank you very much for everyone watching. Thank you for our podium sitters, the ones that are left, of course. Um, and then we will see you next week for the F1 division at 